Hello again and welcome back. I am Faintly Saintly and this is Edamon. Now, uh, <laughs> the last episode, which was the introduction to this game, I stupidly thought that it would remember my progress and that I'd be able to continue my run. Uh, that was not the case. So the episode ended suddenly uh, thinking there'd be an episode two and obviously that's not happening. So we're back to the start. <laughs> All right. That's fine though, we know a little bit more about what we're doing this time, so it's going to be hopefully a little bit uh, more successful. Last time I went with Kreeze, because I had um, liked the idea of the shield, and in the end we had a pretty strong shield run happening. This time I think I'm going to go with Belief. Something different, now that I know how allies work and how, uh, how many allies you get and how quickly, I think this is not unreasonable. Um, I don't know if you can hear that. My cat is screaming at me. Please bear with me. Of course, cats need attention, and while I am making videos, they're not getting attention, and they're not happy about it. But they are spoiled, so they will survive. All right. The going belief is a bug grass type mystery event. We've got a campsite. Might just come up this way. Move around that way. We'll start with bug air. Let's see what we run into. Ah, okay, I'll start with the knock again. Interesting. Eblo. Not an emoji geo dude. Don't get it confused. Um well he doesn't have a super, so it doesn't really matter if he's triggering that once. That's fine. Okay. This should hopefully just be pretty straightforward. Easy done. Victory. Get some money. We can get the Peblo on the team. When hurt, he gains. On f explode. On faint, deal one damage per stack to enemies split evenly and one fast. Reduce required energy by one, is that it? Right, so it's like a little bit of a ticking time bomb. On hurt, move backwards. On attack, applied to decay. On random enemy. I'm gonna get a health bar. Hmm. On attack, target takes one damage. Let's go to K. Your one up. After super grant ally two max. On attack, attacker gains one max. Really? On attack. Sure, why not? Okay, I'm gonna put that on you. I'm gonna put you up to the front. That's pretty good, I think. And I'll grade my belief here eventually. But not yet. Move on. The Guardian. The Kittle. Uh, just wanna check water is good against. Sorry, grass is good against water. Bug is good against water as well. It's good against Toxic and Dusk. Alrighty. Yeah, I'm happy with this order. At the start, the leaf triggers uh, Peblo's super. He gets some explode as well. Pretty straightforward. Who do we get? Sardian. When you fainted, gain one attack and one speed. Go for him. Get the money. Any fainted. So if he stays back until the end, hopefully everyone will faint before him and he'll get the buffs. So I just want to look at this guy again. When he's hurt, he gains two explode and one fast. 
and then when he faints, the explode is split evenly and does damage across the enemies. Okay. Yeah, I quite like that idea. Alright, I think we'll go to the mystery event. One of your party found some flyers for a free training session hosted by an expert fighter. When you enter the gym, the Katamon hosting welcomes you with open arms. They gesture you to the ring, having laid out three different training regimes for you to follow. Gain a folding chair, gain a heavyweight belt, gain a training weight. Uh, a folding chair sounds funny. Wrestling, cardio, uh, alright. A folding chair we got apparently. I think do I have to be at the campfire to apply that, do I? Um Okay. Yeah, let's just go. So belief will trigger his super, so he starts with some explode as well. This little fella, worm. Okay. There's 12 explodes. When he dies, he's going to split 12 damage between all the enemies, which is interesting. 14 now. 18 now. Okay. Not too bad. Got a summoner. Let's speed things up a little bit. I think I might be in trouble here. Died. But we get our pick of a Katam on here. Yeah, it's gained fifty percent of thorns as shield. Not bad. Belief, Lumance. Well, Rakel was alright for us last time, but I think I'm gonna go for the bonus experience here. Yeah, we lost our little fella there. So, hurt. Deal two damage to the attacker. <laughs> sure. Nibolt. Grub buddy. He could be good. save my currency at this point. Go up into the right. Now we're outnumbered here. Butte. Ally summon, deal two damage to back enemy. Any revived. I don't think any of these are summoners, thankfully. We have a bit of a mishmash team and only three against four, so we might be up against it here. Five damage and one something to the fastest enemy, one shock. Deal five to the back enemy. Look at a nibolt. Fine, how much money have I got? Eight. I can afford to upgrade belief. He'll evolve. To a stagnant. What does he do? Battle start. Trigger two allies ahead super one time. Nice. I'll put you back then. Your super is deal five and one shock. Yeah, that's fine with me. In the gains. Pretty experienced unit grains grass type. Uh, okay. 
Who can use the experience more? I think Peblo. Do I? Yeah, I'll have to see what he evolves into. We move on. He faint. You know what? Okay, no, that's fine. Uh, peeling is here. I love that little dude. Alright. Okay, yeah. Pretty sure Pebble did a bit there. Did equal first damage for us. 27. Yeah, when he builds up that explosion and then dies, he just smacks the enemy team. Get appealing. Ally ahead hurts. Grant them one max and I take two damage. I don't know. Let's see that working for me. I'm going to upgrade Sardian. So we've got two very close to leveling up now, which is nice. And do I want a mystery event or a campsite? I'm gonna go to the campsite. Go this way. Para swoop. Eculet. Sardian and Dute. Done. Alright, Peblo levels up. Sardian levels up. Pebble becomes Orbital. When he's hurt, he gains four explode. That's up from two. And his super is now eight up from four. And Sardian is evolving as well. Whalebone. That's cool. I'll have a look at him. Any fainted gain two attack and two fast. And his specialist deals six to a unit ahead. I like that, he's just a bit weak, isn't he? Health-wise, that is. Uh, I'm going to recruit. I do like the Paranute. He's very cute. Eculet. Ally attack, gain one speed. A specialist deal one damage per my fast to the front enemy, then remove all fast. Oh, I see. I think I'll upgrade Sardian again. Give him a little head start to the next level. Hey. Okay. Any close? Not really. Your bolt could be the next one to level up. Here we go. Revolt. When anything faints, he grants allies 15 energy. And then his specialist deals 7 damage and 2 shock to the fastest enemy. And shock means the target takes 1 damage per stack on attack and then pass all stacks to a random ally. Interesting, so he can cause a bit of chaos there. Lovely. Travolt, they've got one as well. An Oracle, a Sardian, and a Dute. He's got 24 explode now. 32. He just shredded him. Hurt. Grant allies behind 3. Energy. Hurt apply 5. Decay. While shielded. I'm going to skip and get a small candy. And... Gonna get some bonus experience for my side in. Unequip, gain five experience and consume.
Who needs an item? You do. After ally super, deal one cold to the fastest enemy. Or one slow, sorry. On attack, apply to decay. Gained fast, grant a random ally one max HP. I'll just put decay, because this guy has decay as well, so that could be just absolutely spreading it around. Doing lots of indirect damage. Oh, now the miniboss kicked my butt last time. I think I'll go to this. And... I'll upgrade my whalebone. Guess he didn't have enough to evolve. How do I look at my team? Not quite. Okay. Let's go. Boss fight. Ah, uh, Queen Struction. That's right. This is the spawner, and it's a massive pain. But any faint, any faint, that would include all their spawns, right? So this could actually be fantastic. Well, let's just see how we go. I think we're doing okay. Benefiting from all these feints, definitely. Lovely. Yeah, so that, that build sort of benefits from having lots of enemies come through, which is good. All summons gain the item of the summoner. Any fainted allies gain... Uh, gain five energy. Okay. Moved ally grants two shield. Um... I don't know. More candy. I'll just do that. One attack, gain two attack, and take five damage. Get a health potion, money, and a ticket. Health potion can go on. Actually, I'm gonna level you up. I'm not, but you get a health potion anyway. Uh, I don't have six dollars, so I can't do any of that. Okay. The Mohiu region. Mystery event, mystery event, mini boss. Mini boss, mini boss. Either way, I'm facing a mini boss, aren't I? So I'm gonna just head up this way. A Fluffern. It's a summoner. I'm a Chillo, a Renute, and Duped. Very creative creature design in this one. Always run the risk when you are uh, obviously inspired by something like Pokemon that your designs aren't going to be original, but I think they've done really well here. I'm going to recruit a. Hmm. Armachillo. Over. So applied. Mm, yeah, I'm a chillo. Hello, regen triggered, gain one health. Okay. I can't take that off at the moment, I need to replace it. That will come. Minoink. Rakel, trainee. Trainee, sorry. We'll move on. Bug water. Ice bug. Bug water. Okay, I recall Prophecy. Oh, I've had that one. That's the evolution of the. What was it the Oracle? That's fine.
Wonderful. Whalebone is maxed out now. What's he going to turn into? Skeleton. Bit feisty, isn't he? Then he fainted, gain four attack and three fast, and deals 12 damage now to the unit ahead when he has his supercharged. Nice. Uh, what do I want here? Um, He'll do. Hopefully, any fainted. Yeah. Cool, cool. Move on. Mini boss. Farmok. It's an evolution of the little fella that you start with. On attack, trigger other allies' attacks. Especially summon one Sapok. Well, he's a summoner. Hopefully, these guys will make most of that. did. Field effect. After super, deal one damage to all units. Field also grants thorns. Volcano, sure. Item. We could be getting more, more toxic uh, decay going on. Well applied, remove one frail on a tip, grant ally to attack. Go this toxic slime. So, three units have toxic slime now. So, on attack, apply two decay to a random enemy. So, there'll be a lot of that happening. 14, I should maybe do that. They're a bit closer to leveling up. I think I'll go right. Revolt, Filament, Eldstritch, and Mushiki. Summoner too, isn't it? Yes, it is. I didn't realize he starts with Frail. That's okay. Lovely. Bonus XP for Nibbolt, absolutely. Mogilla. He's got a stagnant as well, and a fatiki. Another summoner. This one's a bit nasty. He's got thorns, and he deals damage to the attacker when he gets hit. So, sorry, he deals. Uh, what is that one? Decay and slow. Nil leveled up. Oh, I'm a choice. Oh, okay. So the, the uh, creatures in your box also get experience from that. Chilladin. Hurt. Apply one slow to the fastest enemy. Gain 75% of all slow as shield. Cool. And Rokorm is also evolving. Wormint. When hurt, gain 50% of thorns as shields. 
and it's he gains four thorns when his super triggers. Wonderful. I'm going to get some extra experience for Stagnant and move on. Propulsion. Aikido. Oral. Prophecy. Oh, these have all evolved. Nice. I'm actually going to restock. Whalebone. Tentaser. Tentaser. After ally super, deal 4 decay to a random enemy. Eldritch. Why has he got a plus next to him? Rescue. Might get the stagnant and get him leveled up. Get him to his final evolution, assuming it is the final. Drill again. <laughs> cool. So, battle start, trigger three allies ahead, super one time, and then grant ally ahead one uh, fortitude and six regen every super. Alright, well you can go at the back now because you will be applying to all of these guys super. Which is handy. And I'll go a campsite and then a mystery event. On ice. I want all brittle to gain experience. Okay, flashy. Advertisements on the main footpath point you towards a Shonka shop. They appear to be having a flash sale with items selling for much cheaper than usual. You must have been quite busy before you arrived as the shopkeeper appears visibly worn out, falling asleep mid-sentence as it attempts to serve you. Steal, gain five currency, battle a mini-boss, wake up, gain two tickets, buy, gain two random items, lose three currency. Uh... Get the tickets, I guess. No harm there. I'm gonna go the campsite way, I think. A Drew Merc, Ferment, Peblo, and Filament. We got this. Twenty-four explode, thirty-two explode, thirty-six explode, forty. Damn. Holy moly! Forty-nine regen, thanks to being behind or in front of drill again. Six hundred and seventy-nine damage. Amazing. Uh, yes, bonus experience, please. He's getting close now. Ally summon gain 5 energy. On attack, deal 3 damage to a random enemy. I'll buy that. Okay, easy as that. One health, make him a bit tankier. Campsite. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, no, let's evolve him. See what he becomes. Gem packed. That's pretty cool. What does he do? When he's hurt, he gains six explode and two fast. And his super is 12 explode and 9 frail. Interesting. He's an air earth. Alright, we're up to the boss. Am I? No, I'm not. <laughs> I was looking at the wrong side of the map. Okay, Smogilla, Chilladin, Luchalor. That's a new one. And Tentaser. for that one. Alright, 
So when the battle starts, he gets 12 explode. And every time he gets hit, he gets six more. Pretty good. Like, he already softens up the enemy team something fierce, so... It's like 48 already. So he died, he essentially did 12 damage to every, every enemy. I'll grab that. Um, after Ally Super, deal four. That's, that could be good. That could uh, work well with my guy who sets off three supers at the start of the round. Um, I suppose I'll just get bonus experience for the chillet and sit in the box. Who needs more attack? the chance then to evolve to revolt. What does he become? Plus home. <laughs> cool. Oh, plus home. Any faint grant allies 20 energy, 9 damage and 3 shocked to the fastest enemy every super. Lovely. Up to the boss. Knockard, knockard, knockard. Okay, that's like what we started with. And knocking. Enemy gain status, gain one of that status. Oh. He's going to get explode. Oh dear. going to get explode. And every time someone faints, this guy gets attack and speed. Oh dear. Okay, well. <laughs> Rest in peace to me, I think. in the region as well. He's getting everything. Right, what are we supposed to do? Might be able to shot if we can keep this up. Doing it. Yes. And survived the explosion. Awesome. Skeleton. Bloody carrying. 302 damage. Awesome. Field effects. Turn all dust types into physical and physical into dusk. Allies heal too. Pretty harmless, I suppose. Uh, that one, I guess. Another ticket. The chance to use that, but that's okay. I'm gonna restock the shop now. Chimpire. Okay. Prophecy, Chimpire. Beat him up.
Trail applied, gain one shield. This guy deals nine frail. That's interesting. The chair is good, but he gets frail applied quite often, right? Let's try that. And we go to the inner inner moo region. I think we'll go to the mystery event this time. Or or, or brittle brute brute barb. After battle, spawn a bull baby or grant one at twenty experience. Wow. Gestum. Before battle, copy the Kedamon two spaces ahead passive. Right. Get us over it. Dramas. Grab him, I suppose, is a bit different. Into the collection. Avarilla. Interesting. Deal to Dizzy to three random enemies. Then he gains strength and thorns for that. Well, hopefully, we can kill him pretty quick. Didn't lose a single guy. Mengutan. Grab that, level this guy up again, why not? While setting up camp for the night, you watch the sunset when you notice a giant Katamon flying in the distance. You have never seen this Katamon before, perhaps it's a symbol of good fortune. Rest, gain 30 morale, gain 3 currency, gain campfire. I think I want that one. And I guess I'll go this way. Banuck. Aquana. There's some very cool designs in there. Explosion absolutely wiped them out. Alright, I'll get this guy on the team finally. Not change anything. Zoom bus again. Okay. Chill. So attack happening. Uh, zoom bus and some money. Heaven piercer. A light heal. Deal two damage to the furthest enemy. That's pretty good. Let's put that on him. Yep. Give him some health as well. So what's he on? 61. Oh, I misclicked. Oh, he's on 61 too now. <laughs> no dramas. Do you want to give someone ice? Not the, dr not the drug, the, the element. I'm not sure about that. I haven't really played with the elements too much. Bye. I haven't really thought that deeply about my team composition in term of, terms of element. Um, I guess I'll give someone 30 experience, but who do I want to level up? Kind of like Banuck.
Actually, he's closer. I'll just get him to evolve. Chillin becomes Centillion. Okay, when hurt, apply two slow to the fastest enemy and gain 100% of all slow as shield. Nice. Swanana. <laughs> Wonderful. Flame belt. Any faint gain one battle which one attack which stays between battles. Ridiculous. Beautiful. I kind of want you just for your item. What is it? A flame belt. Any feint. Gain one attack. Which stays between battles. So it kind of puts you like on... Relegan. So he's got nine attacks. So let's see how that changes, as it thinks faint. Nine attack, I must remember that. Look at that, damn it, look at it. Icy crawl. Lovely. So there was at least five faints there. stays between battles. Didn't seem to apply though, did it? Still a nine. I got a misunderstanding that. Go a mystery event. Come across a wee velve sitting alone at a table. It is rolling dice repeatedly, seemingly entertaining itself with a board game of some sort. They meet your glance and just a few to join, continuing to roll all the while. Play. 50% to lose 3, 50% to gain 3 currency. What are they again? Gold. Randomize all currently owned items. Gain a weighted dice. Sure. What does that do? Find out, I suppose. Boombus, Aquana, Taikido, Wellbone. Nothing we haven't seen before. Easy done. Doom bus and some gold. Play the dice before attack. Deal two damage to three random Katamon. That's probably better than Toxic Slime, right? That belt still hasn't done anything for you. Ally heal, deal two damage to the furthest enemy. I'm going to do that because you are giving him regen. So there will be some healing happening. And that will just uh, start spitting out damage, right? Hopefully snipe one or two. Minute game's dusk. I don't think I want anyone to gain dusk, do I? Can't tell. We can level up. Eld Stritch is probably closest. On to the boss. K 
cow thesis enemy faint summon one random portal or is super easy to summon one random portal no idea what that means what is this pause 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 So is he just summoning random level threes or something? All right, carry on. Hello. Let's break it. I think the game has just crashed. Well, not crashed, but frozen. Am I missing something? Mm. Well, that is a big shame because I thought I was going pretty well there. Got a nice team. Um, but unfortunately, it looks like it ends here. story don't pause the battle all right i guess i'll leave it there thanks for watching i'm faintly saintly if you like this please subscribe helps a lot keeps you in the loop when new videos drop if you want to see more of this game um hopefully which will be receiving a a little patch to fix a few of these things very soon um let me know otherwise if you have any game suggestions or feedback just leave them in the comments and i will 100 try to get back to every single one of you so thank you again and i will see you next time